I feel like say, he must say something about the artist. Which artist? No, I'm just saying the artist's name is Critique. Yeah. And our other artists, you're welcome to comment and yeah. leave your criticism. However. And the artist. But remember, you're an artist too. Yeah. So if you live in a glass house. Do not. Do not throw stone. We repeat, do not. And if you want to throw stone, make sure you say you're also make with bulletproof glass. Because <laughs> shot might be fired back over your Shots side. Fired. Exactly. Are you just bad, you know? But if you wanna uh, if you wanna be critique, what you can do, you can critical. log on to our YouTube yeah. channel and just go onto the video them. Yeah. And if you're, you leave know, your comments there, be critical yeah. on the previous videos. And be know? honest. Honesty yes. is the best of policy. Yes. So sometimes it, it's, it's even better that you, you say what you actually feel in your mind. Cause sometimes people think away and they don't really say it out loud. Them yes. edit what the muggers think yes. in their mind and because they don't want to look a certain way. Yes. And um, I think. Yeah. Honesty is always the best policy. Not you know? true. Like that's true. That's not the only life, way. When it, when when you're honest with with, the, with, the, with, the, with yourself first, cause in a life, you can't be nobody else with yourself. And you see when when you when you when you come to peace with yourself. Mm -hmm. Like when me know me just is a dirty drunko, me just know you know. Uh, all right. We see like when you say that. Yeah. There's a post that I saw today. Yeah. From a particular artist mm -hmm. who's very critical of other artists yeah mr vegas mm -hmm. has po he posted I, I thought he was silent no 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 He's, he did say something today and i was kind of really interested in the post that he made mm -hmm. so he commented on to because he performed at the can uh, the cardi b show right yeah. so this is what he says unlike nikki and drake cardi sincerely loves dancehall she does not see it as a little flavoring for albums or remixes. Mm -hmm. The Queen dedicated her birthday to with culture. Mm -hmm. Pasa Pasa Danza. This is how you know she is not a vulture. Mm -hmm. I have a problem with this. I yeah, have a big problem too. Car yeah. Me, 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 me watch this too from start to finish. All juggling a fucker. Yep. Who was, see, who was see, that DJ that was... And yeah. now I pour them. You see, you see me did now I pour. You remember Apple J? Yeah. But go buy one crate of them and fling you after you know. But no, but me yeah, think got up a we don't no, no pull on now. Yeah. We don't juggle like say. We don't dip. Remember at them claim say them love dance and no yeah. dance alone. Them yeah. No the water that, long in juggling. The more that blood clot, little uptown music like 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 like, like say yeah. You, you know when it, when it, when in a Soho and them place there in a yeah. England. Here there are some places where you say them them clot. Uncle 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 artists them people I know are Bob Marley, yeah. Shaggy and Sean Paul. Yeah. Pia them fuck with it and go out with right, let, Let's go back to the post. For the, the Vegas post. Why my basically my big up Cardi because Cardi book him for I proper. Vegas get some money. So this is I right, me not get the bookings, you know? If <laughs> if you have to try to be honest, if you try to be honest, <laughs> Nicki Minaj actually do a record with a dancehall artist. With yeah. a dancehall dance dance artist. With more than one. But yeah, more than one. Song. Yeah. But it, the last one we should do is killing was. Yeah. But, uh, whether it's good Just or not. But Cardi B, ha done. Cardi B hasn't cool? done a song with any dancer artist, to my knowledge. Oh wait, no. Cover oh, that's Cardi. Nicki Minaj. I'm sorry, not Cardi. True, yeah. you're but right. But that's why that's why I find. So all you can love dancer if you not doing with that. Yeah, but that's why I, I find Mr. Vegas the post, and he's always the one who's culture. Great. You see, you see, me like when them chat early and they mm. come back on buffing them face. You see, only person who I see in the hip hop scene mm. who have a love for dancer, I would say is DJ Khaled. Khaled. Yeah. The rest of them. A pussy all them. Yeah, but, but even though even though Khaled is a pussy all in a sense. Yeah, but to be honest, you can't really blame them because dancehall is not their thing. They don't owe it no homage. No, mm -hmm. no, they don't own of course they owe dancehall homage. Oh, dancehall oh. is reggae music and dancehall is the culture where it start hip hop. So there's a lot of owing of homage there. Yeah, but we owe if our we, culture start this thing. We don't owe hip hop shit. No, but the, they but owe us everything. Alright, let's 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 if you bring it down to that now. Mm. We owe Africa everything and we do not show Africa. We hate Afrobeat artists because Afrobeat is doing well. No, we don't eat Afrobeat artists. Don't get it twisted. You we, we them? No, we I don't eat them, but we we try to say basically that we shouldn't put up um dance against Afrobeats. Which really and truly Afrobeat is doing better streaming wise than dancehall music and uh, jo most jamaicans are you cannot compare afrobeats with dance no but no but the fuck what let me explain what i'm saying yeah. is because you're saying that hip-hop does not owe us any homage uh mm -hmm. well basically well that's something what i said that you're yeah. saying that mm -hmm. but you know i get confused up 
I'm saying that Jamaican music dance hall come from Africa. It, it's mixed. It's, it's, Le- it's, not, it's not fully because, all right. No, let me explain what I'm saying. Mm. I'm saying that dance hall is some part of African culture, of African music. But yeah. we do not show the African culture any homage either. What? A lie you tell. How do we do it? What? What? A month, a month of music will lose them things, so they want to go my repatriation and scissor and all of them. <laughs> Ricky, now you're not know, listening to your music good enough. Yeah, no, but what you mean that we're not sure no, African no, homage? But we're not, we're not, we're not emphasize the African art. Praise you, Ja. You want to go back to Babylon. But Yo, listen, I'm not listening. I'm, I'm, I'm not listening to my talk, but a man don't know where call the God knows. Yeah, but we're not saying <laughs> that we, we, we're not giving that. Uh, are we giving Davido? No, the big up point is supposed to get because I just a few music I come from. Why, why we should give David a big up when our, mu- our, our music and our culture have been established before theirs? Remember, I you know. No, you, Africa, I come no, from. No, 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 no. Africa, everything yeah, come from. Everything, our our culture come from Africa, but not the music. The music has Rick, come from Africa Rick, as well. So, hold on, so Rick, what bring music? Rick, culture hold on, bring it. Rick, hold on, man. All right, clear Our, says, our culture, because we're, we're from African descendants. Mm. So basically, we got Jamaica and we get the, the mix over the generation. We get the English people them, and the Spanish them and African because we are African by birth. So over over time, mm-hmm. we start to form our own language. That's why we speak with our own like a Creole, the patois, right? Yeah. So we, we have our culture. A lot of things we do similar, and like we have a lot of things we do like we African people do because we are African by birth. Some of the culture going to stay, but some of it. We found by yourself like our unique language. Yeah. Our things that we do and and the music that we sing is unique because obviously we have a music and have a genre before anywhere else in Africa. Okay. And any other big big genre in Africa because dance hall music was out at least two decades <laughs> before Afrobeats come up company scene, right? Yeah. So how can we pay homage to them when their music start off of dance hall? Because remember Danza was the dominant music in the continent of Africa. All right. Let me explain. Let me let me say my justify myself. Mm. What's the, the common identity of dance music? What do you use most of all to identify dance? Rastafari. No. Uh, all right, Africa. Let, 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 let me explain, mm. man. The dance music is known basically by the jump patterns. Am I right or am I wrong? Yeah. Where did we get this jump pattern from? What 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 what's what jump pattern? This boom 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 boom. I don't know. It it start it start from chant in the Congo the jump. Ex- so where does this, this chant from Congo jump comes from? Why them them want say it come from Africa, but I'm talking them about w- the lyrics. <laughs> no, but that is the BS. This is the, the alright. This yeah. is. It doesn't matter. How you talk. You talk about body, body, get a jump part. No, all right. Let and me make. When they start, wait, hold on, Rick. Cause no, that, me, you're not giving a chance. You know me. You take it your forward. Let me take my uh-huh. forward. No, let's use something different. Let's yeah. use a whole different mm-hmm. terminology. We know that um, Mercedes Benz is made by German, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, mer- everything Mercedes uh-huh. is German. We know that. Yeah. But then Mercedes have a whole lot different. You have B class, you have S class, mm-hmm. S class, or whatever. A different class. Mm-hmm. But all of Mercedes mm-hmm. carry them right now, it goes back where? To Germany because it's Mercedes is made in, in Germany and Germany is the origination of Mercedes Benz cars. Yeah. So no matter how much different design you want to make of it, mm-hmm. it's where it comes from. It's always going to be known as a German yes. car. It's the same as the reggae as the identity, identified as jump pattern, which is the boom, boom, boom. The jump pattern, where does jumps come from? Africa and Africa alone drum did all over. No, but it, no, Africa. Africa is known for that type of drum. But There's Rick, other drums Rick. elsewhere, but they play different. Rick, we're talking about where the music starts and where it found. Where it's originated. Where from. originated from. Mm-hmm. All right. So it originated from Jamaica. It did. It didn't come from the boat from Africa to Jamaica. No, but no, I, I'm that, not that, debating that's what, where that's, it comes from. That's why we are talking. Like, all right, we see a lot of people get inspired from different things from all over the world. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But the music mm-hmm. start from Jamaica in, inspire about what the people have got through. Remember, our music changed so much to the reggae we know now because remember, them go scare, then go rock steady, then they go reggae, and then you have a spin off and go dance all. And if you check a scare rock steady song, remember the earlier days of it. 
it was not inspired by nothing African. It was inspired by, by the American music where they used to hear on records. Mm -hmm, right? And the rock steady and them thing they, then then them flip it again and you know them go some live some live drum. And then we get reggae music. That's that tree say our music don't really inspire by um a lot of the African culture. I'm saying African culture is in it, but it's not too much. Okay. So Jamaican music have its own identity. All right, so let's get back with the post. That we experience, we have a tender. Yeah. Um, yeah. The Nikki and the Drake side that. Mm -hmm. So basically, you must say you know like Nikki and you like Drake. Because Why was he there? Exactly. So this is it, it, it's, 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 not, it's, it's Cardi B's thing. thing, but I mean Nikki and Cardi are in the same line, same no. type of music, Cardi same B kind of like thing. Nikki and Nikki and like Cardi, so you have yeah. pick a side. Me not pick no side. But but this is why this is why I think that it was a booking that they got. Because this money run, of course. Oh, uh, yeah, I this agree. money run because Vegas is not in the loop of anyone. No, he's he's no, no exactly. Well, he's not doing anything. <laughs> no, 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 no. You see, we we wanna misunderstand about yeah. Vegas, Rick. Yeah, yeah, DJ. Well, we, uh, when yes, when yeah, you go yeah, anywhere, yeah. in he, terms he, he of he dance hall, he, he top Sean Paul and Vi, uh, Sean Paul and Vegas in other like a nineties. Yeah. Yeah. And, 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 and them and the big song them were international in the nineties. So, so that's, that's, why, that's why that's why it lead, it that lead says a booking. It looked like the Sean Paul couldn't make it, so that's why Vegas like still did on behalf. No, no, that's why I'm telling him give some free dub because him, him couldn't, couldn't make it. All right, that's why. No, no. We're not here to dub them. So, we're not here to the dub them. So, I saw my tie store together. Oh, yeah. me have a next book in us. So, here we know. We'll have some freedom. See? No, here, card. We'll have some freedom. You know, I'm going to send Vegas here. So, if anything, no, no, no. when when when, when they play, make it come to Then they want to get Vegas. Like, I, I see what, what you're trying to do. She's trying to get, like, the the past. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the present. The, the, the middle stage, which is Spice and the future. Shensi and Ding Dong. Yeah, uh, only man Missy really represent was Ding Dong. Yeah, yeah. Ding Dong do. Because I don't think Shensi what, performed. What Ding she Dong just did an does. appearance. Yeah, Shensi does go there and try to look as pretty. A, as a princess, yeah. because the queen was in was present. Well, I look at MC like Bravo, you know. Yo. Yeah, man, Bravo. Yo, Bravo listen, is man. the me don. Me feel you like said Don of all don, bro. Yo. You know, you know a lot of people overlook Bravo and when he he's do ding excellent dang. at what yeah. he does. Let me tell you this. He's yeah. excellent at what he does. I'm he's sorry. He's not Ding Dang alone. No, he's the sir. star. Yeah. Bravo enhances ding his dang performance. Ding Dang a star. Bravo, Bravo a star a too. Star. Big ding a star. A moon. I agree. Bravo yeah. a moon too. I agree. Yeah. But Bravo. I agree. Big up Bravo. Big you need to advise one like a song though. Yeah, man. But a beer ski. If you. It has too much screaming. I don't think I could have managed that one. It's more screaming. I'm all right, okay. I'm all right. 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 I'm all is that one of them man that him twins have twins that can't family? That him, you can't even And then on mass. top of that, his stage present. If you watch him performing, he he perform he's like performing yeah, as right. if it's his set. Yeah, yeah. And like, that is why I say no, he no, accentuates the, the whole yeah. performance Ding of Dang the Ravers. Is the artist, but like, you see, if Ding Dang going anywhere, if no other members of Ravers is not going, Bravo has to. Bravo is the Bravo right has hand to. man. Has and to. you realize that, like, I realize, like, um, uh, we call it Ramesh do something mm -hmm. and a lot of people don't think about it and say oh malicious it, it is mm -hmm. because all you should should say ding dang right mm. out of rivers clavers and you don't invite him crew that means say uh, you are try to break up something that's already good what do you mean invite the crew explain no, no, that no, no. in a sign rivers no well, I know. I'm asking him to explain if, so ding dang is a package Right. Right? Mm hmm So, remember, you know, on a Rivers Clever sign, Ramesh Entertainment has just ding dong. Mm hmm But it should be a package deal because... But suppose a man money not at all. It's not the man money not at all. You have, you have, you have to kind of invite certain things in a contract because, watch here now, you realize that from when Ding Dong, the likes of Angash, got Ramesh, right? Right. The rest of the Rivers, them the Kind of drop back. Yeah. The Disha, them the rare rare, them. Mm hmm Everybody kind of fought. I just bravo alone because bravo is the right hand man and bravo the panel. I record them. Right. Yeah. And I feel like say um, Remy should have put bravo in at the deal as well because 
If, 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 can't work without Bravo, if, if, if you sign Ding Dang, you can't do so. Just like, um, what do I call it? Like Bishop Escobar mm-hmm. sign. Mm-hmm. But, but Ramesh don't sign. Bishop Escobar DJ will play mix for him. Yeah. But, but, that, that, that is hypocrisy. But yeah, but we don't know the them. fine prints of the mm. deal. So we might look at it and we're assuming no, 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 no. I don't know. It, sh- it should be everybody. Understandable, sh- but we don't know the fine prints of the if deal. Because for me, as a DJ, me, me like, it might, you understand me, sir, Rick? It might look like that fr- at the, yeah, fair, at the but forefront, we really but we on. don't know what the small print or the black, the, the fine details no, no, are. No, but when they advertise who is a part of Ramesh Entertainment, mm-hmm. they are missing, missing. Some of the time when, when they cook the, the whole of food, whole of free food, they invite them around and say, yeah, man, food, they are not come eat. But, but I still stick to my point, aspect. we don't know what the fine print is. I, I get what you're saying. But we don't know the fine print. There, there's some breaking. Sorry for cut you, mm. but there's some breaking news forwarding out of Jamaica. Mm. Um, dropped 4:08 p.m., which was yeah. about 10:08 or time, to say that Budge Banton's daughter Abigail Myrie has been reported missing, and the police are seeking the help of the public to locate the 21-year-old um, daughter of the reggae entertainer Mark Budge Banton Myrie, who has been reported missing since Saturday, October 9th. The police say that Abigail was last seen at home. She's of a dark complexion, slim build and is about five feet eight inches tall um there's a lot of things that has been happening over the weekend mm. on her instagram page mm. and her twitter pages i don't know there's a back and forth thing where she's trying to prove that her father has been abusive to herself as well as some other siblings yeah. um yeah would you um and there was a p- yeah her father i did call his name earlier um um and if you take a look at her Instagram page, a lot of people have been saying that her latest post, especially this morning, ap- apparently there were some posts made on her Instagram page that kind of never sounded like her. So apparently her Instagram account has been hacked. Don't mm. know how true it is, but I'm just reading the reports that are coming through. So people in Jamaica, if you don't have any, inf- any information, go to the police station, yeah, call the police and, and, s- and help to get her home safely. Hopefully she's in a safe yeah, place and sure. in a good mental space. And if she's not in a good mental space, she'll get the, s- the necessary support that she needs. Yeah, yeah. Um, yes, yeah, kind of yeah. unfortunate. Uh, uh, hope oh, 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 them get to her quick campus. Yeah. Um, yeah. Big and up Foley than online. Yes, yeah. big up everybody that is... Uh, Foley than so basically say in, in, in regards to the argument. Him mm. sign an artist, not a crew, and maybe ding dong sell out. Who know? You don't know the fine print, my G. Like, I forgot to call Ding Dong and find out. I have a Rita. Me, 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 Rick, is a lot of these Jamaican artists sell out because, um, as when I realized the past couple of weeks, um, I'm not the biggest popcorn fan, fan anymore because mm-hmm. I realized say, he's a talented artist, but in terms of moving the culture forward, he's selfish. Yeah. In terms of how him doing thing, mm-hmm. we know him always have a couple of people running, but. He's not the one who to put them to the forefront. He's mm. not a leader, and not a good um, leader. Yeah. No, we, we, we see him in England for a, for a, for a long, a long time. period of time. Mm-hmm. And if you realize when him there, we him run. Yeah. No run, no, no, not, not our, our people. type of people. Him run, the little trap man, them, and the little <coughs> grime man, them, are them the type of man that him mm. want be around every time because he's a person, we other call it, no way. What he can do for me, he's mm. more an opportunist. Mm. Than bring somebody to get an opportunity. Mm. Like no, you see, he one in a, in the Africa now. You can't tell me somebody bring the unruly squad. But no, you can not cause them fall out and be a things. But at least even one of them. Even quarter. Yeah, so you can not bring one of them on them. Mm. Cause remember Africa, you don't need no visa for go there. So you can mm. not bother the fuckery. Mm-hmm. And tell me say, oh, England, the man them not. You don't need no visa for go Africa. True. See? So certain thing, we have a pre certain thing and watch here now. Him go over there, and him go flourish the Afrobeat thing. And rare, rare, just like what I'm going to do with the Drake culture. Mm-hmm. And I'm not really bring nobody in a certain way. Why am I learning from Drake? No, I don't really learn from Drake. Because that's what <coughs> Drake does. That's what Drake do to him. Mm. But if I learn from Drake, but I do it the wrong way because I'm not have nobody in a female place. So that's why him and him friend are follow because they realize that it's a boy I'm selfish. Yeah. Well. And when you're selfish, because remember, if I follow back here five years, you know. Yeah, I feel. Seeing? Something, something. I don't know, don't feel me, you know, mm. like, if more, if, if, if more, like, a guest in a car, me, I say, yo, Rick, you know, more I want 10 grand to buy some gas. Mm. Help me if some of can start with my own well, money. money mm. yeah, exactly. Mm. Because we, we see other artists do it. In a Jamaica, look how much artists want to kill a bus. Cartel. We see even smaller artists than Popcorn. I shoot people through the gate. Governor, I try to build, I try build I for them. Look, squash. Yeah, even squash for Look how much, much people squash bring through the gate and make them say six. Mm. 
I remember Unruly was a long time before six. Yeah. What Unruly artist? Remember Unruly signed um, Chichin Ching one night time and Chichin Ching have to run the man go, go to Richard Paul. Because True. him now help him. Yeah. It's a, it's a thing yeah, Eric, he was like, doing that tour for a really long time. Yeah, 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 t- yeah t- about it. Remember, Pop can't keep him big show over here. Mm-hmm. And none of them know about it. And him not bring none of them artists them. And none of them artists them. That's shaky with you. So, yeah, yeah, so, yeah, 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 have to look on the business and say, yo, some of these artists, they are very talented and we love them, but mm. when they come here, they remember not you for the Jamaican. Yeah, remember, I see him when he come here, I remember him this queen because him feel like, say, yo, then I look on him league and think if now that to be in there because obviously being in them established and blah blah blah. Mm. Being a man in general. Them need to remember them roots. Remember them roots. Because True. you want to know, you see, anytime <coughs> your career go down because remember when an artist, mm. when you now have for 20 years. True. See, Drake have hip hop lock up for about 10, for about 10 years, one decade. And him drop a new up. project and watch you now. See there now. Foolishness. Mm. Look like, like nobody's s- talking about the latest. Like Smarty Slide tackle him now and yeah. kick away yeah. He dropped a, he 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 dropped a project a couple months ago. Can you tell me at least one song on a project? No. Can you tell me one song on a project? He flap. Exactly. No, but that's what music is. Exactly. You don't you don't really but that's why when you're on top, you need to make as much use at the time mm. and try to help as much when you're Look on top. Thing. Not when you're struggling. I wait till you start fall off and start to collab with all them and them because if you realize Popcorn does not have a lot of collabs, and most of the collabs that he does have Friend are them. like people who he might try to get something from. He don't really give back nothing to, to the use them where we're coming up. Notice not for the use them, all ah, you have no collab with even Quadda. Mm-hmm. The only name of you collab with Popcorn. Even though no, they had artists in Jamaica when you should have collab with, he don't have none. He don't have none. Because mm. you want know, to, he have a couple collab with a couple of you say, run like the Dre Island, them are because because them run. Because them, yeah. So people run him, he would do some one song, one and two song with them. Yeah. But like in Jamaica, like, who you know I hear popcorn and intense or popcorn and skilly or a popcorn and, and what, you know, when I had to ask them down the yeah. trending. Remember when him do a collab with Movado? When him and Movado was good, see? Mm. Because Movado is a big artist. Because Movado is a potential. Yeah. Not Thinking those things all the while. Do you have a popcorn eye down here? No. Nobody on popcorn. Like th- that, that that's that's the thing we are trying to tell about. Like, say yo, if we pre this guy, when I realize say he's very selfish. I've always think it. Bad yeah. artist, but there's a there's a Not lot for of them, like, it, so go on. He there's come something. like like me kind of pre him like Jack here in a sense, and him have him have a lot of traits of Jack here. You know, yes, I mean look like him out now. Yeah, Jack here. Well, him lock up in a prison. He was stabbing people them last week. Mr. What? Mr. What? I'm post. Mr. What? I'm post. He look and like I he saw get him look at like, yeah, cause he's doing a music music video or something. Mr. Like he look like he get bill, but he look like he can't for him. Well, <laughs> that, really. that is that. Um, but are we gonna talk about some upcoming events? Yeah, yeah cause shall time we? is yeah, yeah. Yeah. time is quite limited. Um, it's now seven minutes to the hour of eleven, but we're just gonna run through some places and some things that you can do during the rest of the week and the upcoming weekend. So Tuesdays we're not seafood. Tuesdays at Bar Bar. Wednesdays Simplicity Promotions present Chicken Back Wednesdays. Thursdays Tipsy Thursdays. Fridays Swabber Fridays. Each every friday at club 701 on old kent road and this week pure vibes entertainment and bag of british will be the special guests saturdays so saturdays this and every saturday and this week's special guest will be world power zone don't know world power zone always bring the best of the best for no zine um sunday soul sundays and mondays gangster kids not perfect mondays so make sure you're so out and and go over and enjoy yourselves and at this time we want to send um out again to Queenie. Special condolences to her and her family. She lost her daughter Rochelle last week, aka yeah. Roro. And this Thursday night, October 14th, will be the nine night, which will be held at Falden Fo- Road, N167 UR. So if you can make it out on, on Thursday evening, guys, go out and support if you are able to. Um, and then over the weekend, a number of events will be happening. Um, we spoke about Swift, Swift um, Saturdays, Saturdays, but especially yeah. Saturday, the 16th of October, CB Promotions presents Crystal Blue's 18th year anniversary, the Blue and White Affair, the Elegant and Classy Edition. The, the venue is fully confirmed. Tickets are officially out. There are numerous t- ticket locations, yep. numerous numbers you can call. Check out the Crystal Blue team's Instagram pages. Get in touch with them. Get your tickets. It's going to be a, a, a very great event. Super D has a special house set prepared for us all. So make sure it's on a forward out. 
And people here, what? Them say, holy pa blue bell here over there too. Blue bell here will be there with the light up, light up in there. there. So, so get to the nice, so. class and remember elegant. Remember the, pa- the, pa- the package, the package deals, deals are there, there as well. If you and crew go, right. get one of the package deals. If you tell to how much money you go, you know where something goes. Definitely. It's going to be yeah. a very, very good event. So make sure, and there, obviously we know that there are other events hosting, but these are just a couple fe- couple, couple that we're highlighting. So make sure you want to go out, have a good time and support. Go ahead, Rick. Well, um, just saw breaking news. I uh, see just been posted. Governor, you remember the the, the competition he was doing? Mm. Yes. Uh, he just posted a winner. Okay. Um, so if you want to check out the governor pages, n- contest at number 18 won. Mm-hmm. And also there's another surprise winner as well. Because he had a, the producers pick uh, artists <coughs> as well who mm. they wanted to work with. Right. So contest at number two mm-hmm. will also be added to the compilation officially. So number 18... Contest at number 18, 18 is the winner. winner and then right. Contest at number 2 is also being given a deal as well. Okay, that's so great. congrats to those people. Right, and before I forget, there's another event. Obviously, we're not going to be able to speak about this next Tuesday because it's happening next Tuesday, October 19th. So the official Dancehall episode, Bounce Redeem Launch, which is presented by Dancehall Episode, which is happening next Tuesday, the 19th of October. Doors open at 7 p.m. It's going to be happen- happening at the Hatch Club, 23 Lewisham Way, SE 14 6PP, Featuring Big Zeke, Shanty Four, Super Nitro, Chaps Official, One Lord God, Tear Boss, G Mafia, music provided by Mix Masters UK, Sir DJ Corey, It's DJ Vibes, and DJ Stylo. This event is going to be a very great one because we're going to see some bad, bad artists pan mm-hmm. a bad, bad redeem. Ladies and gentlemen, make sure it's going to get. We're not going to support the thing. Of yeah? course, the UK artists. Exactly. Yes, let's support our UK. I've seen something. Um, what, when is Flames? Um, Flames, Radios, yeah. Summer Dreams. Summer Dreams. Let uh, let's me. get that because I've seen that there was a Summer Dream. It's an old school yes, um, event. Yes, versus new school. Let me just get that information up for you. Big up the old school because I feel like old school. Are so, take yeah, it. So, old so man already. Well, uh, what, yeah. what old school pan you have? Um, um, so this is going to be happening so on Sunday. So Israel School and Young Ones are new school, right? Hold on. I'm going to tell you shortly. I have DJ Face and what? I'm going to tell you shortly. Yes, I go for the old school. Old school. Man. Old school. Um, yeah. So it's happening on Sunday, 17th of October. Thank you for reminding me, Rick. Yeah. Um, from 4 p.m. to 10 p.m. at the Oval Space. We don't know that's the headquarters of Summer Dreams. Um, it's going to be old school versus new school. That's yes. it? It's, so it's called the old school brunch. Um, who is it? DJ Face, Rocky Boss, Days, Young Ones, Alan Brandon, Loyal Squad. So they're going to be giving you the best in dancehall, reggae, R&B, soca, Afrobeats, and house. And there's a special guest PA by Kelek Rock. I hope I'm pronouncing your name properly. Forgive me if I haven't. So make sure it's on the link up the Flames Radio team or face for more information. Oh, no, no, say Flames Radio events. I'm always stopping. Big up to the real Flames Radio crew. Good vibes. Um, it's always a good vibes. It's always great. One thing them over there. When you take time with the drinks price, them can remember <laughs> we caught now. <laughs> no, I true. Yo, nah. Lee right, talk to them for the drinks price. I true. No need for sort of some package, Lee right. Yeah, Big bad thing so, levels. Know, so both the, you know, cars, a nine to five a day, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Drink the them. <laughs> and, a scam, and a scam on money. Wait, remember, wait, remember wait. me not tapping a dog. From what you cut last doll, no, no, get chopped. <laughs> no choppings now. Nah, cut last doll. <laughs> choppy light, choppy so, light. Let me put it out there. Why, yes. why, why, why this sensible price you're back like in a serious dragon? Over there. No, 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 no. In general. In general, we're not. Listen, we're not telling. Wait, what price size? Why? The smaller the. The no, regular small, size. The, the regular, regular size. size. Sorry, regular size. Just, just for like two seconds. Yeah. The regular size. Two seconds. Yeah, the this one. Dance. Yeah. yeah this pawn. one. Yeah, the phone. That size there. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, the phone. Yeah, the phone. Standard. Good. Standard price. Don't okay. come tell me hundred and twenty no. or one fifty or some stupid price, cause, mate. Mate. <laughs> bro. Don't bro. got a money tree in my backyard, you know. But, yeah. but but listen, you have a PF yeah, to be honest, yeah. The event that's um the, the venue that Summer Dreams keep, when I go in there, I feel like they are Jamaica. It, you're, you feel as if you're at yeah, an event. Yeah, cause the, the, the bass line that kicked me. Yeah. The tapping and everything. And right. the production that is presented, it's always top. So notch. what you say, maybe that warrants the extra twenty, thirty pounds. No, no sir, sorry. Are you mad? Mm-mm. Okay, next time, no pack it, no so tall. You know, me, I'll stop drinking you know, we have something in life, anyways. Moving right along, you know, you know, <laughs> how many times have we heard that statement? Move it further on in the news, oh, ladies and gentlemen. It's one minute to the hour of 11 o'clock. We want to thank you all for joining us here tonight. We enjoyed the company, we enjoyed the in- conversation with critique. Yes. Um, remember, we're here every Tuesday between 9 and 11. We're sponsored by Shush Prince, and one thing that we ask you 
we, we will be asking you to do if you have not done it already go over to our youtube channel like share but more specifically you need to subscribe and hit the notification bell bell because we drop a new video every single weekend and trust me when you can go over there go put in a little comments then put in a little fire put in a little thumbs up or in a thumbs down if you don't like it or if you don't like it, whichever just make sure it's on a go back of support yeah simple all star as i'm saying every week people love your brother love your sister love, love ruling everything you do i want to read a book you know brain poison the main power big up watch the vaccine thing because i don't know how i go on see you guys next week take care have a great week Vax.